heard them from several sources. Uh, yes, uh, Milosevic is not the favorite. In fact, there have been some rather rough resolutions passed in Congress. And again, maybe some will say well, that's only rhetoric, that's mm -hmm. all we have. But I think the Congress is sympathetic to dealing with this problem, and I'm certain when that, uh, if that should occur, they'll have the cooperation <coughs> of the executive branch. So we are watching this very closely. Certainly, if anyone is to be charged with criminal conduct, we think the appropriate independent international forensic experts are the ones who should come in and conduct the investigation in Pletchka or anywhere else, uh, including the many other sites that we are aware of and that we have heard information about during the course of the day. And I'm not just talking, of course, about uh, mass grave sites, but also uh, shelling of civilians. Uh, uh, we heard a, a horrendous story uh, today, which uh, we've also had confirmed in many other uh, areas um, of uh, the shelling of uh, women and children as they sought to flee from uh, Senek several days ago, uh, and a number of them uh, severely wounded. Uh, this is the kind of massive violation of humanitarian law that is uh, subject to investigation. <coughs> Just over here on the left. I think even uh, having watched uh, some of the reports on television is worse than I anticipated. And it's hard to believe that, that man can do this to man. But it's happening, and it must end. Uh, has worked much more directly on the humanitarian issues. Uh, we are actively following. <laughs> Those long trips. Yeah, that's right. That's right. He's kind of my. Senator arrived this morning in. Thank you. The Naturist Pisetu of Virginia and Humanitarian Ecosov. situation. 